Now that you've mastered the three most essential shoes in a men's shoe closet, it's really important to avoid some of these. First of all, do not buy square-toed shoes. And by square-toed shoes, I don't mean the fine chisel toes from English shoemakers. I mean these kind of ugly shoes with rubber soles, big chunky toe boxes, and uh, they simply make you look like a peasant. They're clunky, they're not elegant, they're not stylish, and it doesn't matter if it's a lace-up shoe or sometimes they come in loafers with like elastic sides. They're just horrible and you should avoid them at all costs. Second thing you shouldn't do is to buy the same shoe twice or the same shoe in a different color. I hear you, you just got a pair of shoes and you really love it, it fits well, it looks good on you. Why not buy a second pair, you might think? You're at the beginning of building your shoe closet and maybe if you already have 30 pairs of shoes, you can buy a pair of the same shoe but if you're still, if you're not there yet, what you should do is just buy one style at a time because that gives you more versatility and different looks. And if you buy a quality shoe, you can wear it long enough that you should need a second pair that is exactly the same or just the same style in a different color. What you can do is you can get something on the same last, but it being a different shoe. And that's definitely something to consider because if the fit is right, you want to keep that fit, but you want to change the look. Third don't is to avoid rubber soles. Dress shoes are dressy and you want to have a leather sole because when you walk, it gives that really elegant sound and um, they may be a little more difficult to maintain, but a good leather sole won't let water in even if it's rainy and if you live in an area where it's really wet or the winters are long, you can get rubber galoshes to wear on the outside and then take them off when you're inside. Four, don't buy shoes that are too colorful in the beginning or that they're unusual. Skip the spectators, skip like dark green or blue shoes when you're just starting out. Even though they may be 80% off and on sale and you may like to look, at the end of the day, you're not gonna get a lot of wear out of them and they're gonna stay in your shoe closet and the cost per wear goes up. Invest wisely, take a look at your shoe closet, see what you have, if you don't have the styles I recommend, I really suggest you take a look at them and I promise you it will help you to create a long-lasting, versatile wardrobe that is elegant and stylish for the foreseeable future. If you enjoyed this video, please sign up to our email list and I'll send you more of these videos right to your inbox. And uh, check out our website, gentlemansgazette.com, where we have a lot of material all about classic men's clothing and style. Thank you.